the board can't do anything unless council makes a project. Um, yeah, but we don't have the budget. We can't. We can't. Me do McMillan. It. <laughs> yes, it is. You can you can go straight to the end of the table. We're a little bit ahead of schedule, so thank you. Good afternoon, welcome. Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for having me here today. I am Lee McMillan and I'm in favour of keeping the Wharanui pool open. This is Jess McMillan and Sam McMillan, my two daughters and current members of the Wharanui Swim Club. What does Wharanui mean to us? Wharanui, the name says it all. A meeting house that represents its ancestors and history and contains within it our whakapapa, our people and our family. Without Whirunui, my girls wouldn't be the well-rounded, hard-working young ladies they are today. Just ask their school teachers. Rikidin is a very diverse community. Whirunui offers something for everyone. At an affordable price and in a convenient location, our community can access as many don't drive. Wharanui is about our people, our next generation, protecting and investing what we already have, an extremely unique family facility with a culture that no metro could ever replace. I worry that Wharanui will end up like the Sockburn swimming pool, non-existent and wasting away. 110 years of history, generation after generation coming through the doors. This must count for something, and long may it continue. Jess and Sam have been part of the Wharanui family for the last, since they were toddlers. Jess competed at national level, representing Wharanui. She now is employed at Wharanui as a coach, teaching babies and toddlers to swim giving back her knowledge and skills to the next generation. Sam, for the first time this year, made it to the Canterbury School Swimming Champs. She's never done this before. What a massive achievement for her and a very proud parent moment for me. Furanui is a safe space where my girls have had the opportunity to develop their love and passion for swimming. Others deserve this opportunity too. Through water to glory. This means more than trophies, medals and records. This is about everyone being the best they can be. Personal goals from babies to masters and everyone in between. It is belonging to Team Wharanui. If you close the pool, what is the plan for the Learn to Swim in our club? Where will we go? What happens to our outstanding history? How will you accommodate our diverse community groups? These girls and many other Wharanui swimmers are our future. Please don't let their lasting memories of the Christchurch City Council be. They took our pull. We are a growing city. There's room for both. Wharanui and the Metro. Our rates have increased. This I'm okay with. However, I am not okay with our facilities now be taken away. That's not fair and it is just not right. I'm asking you today, please do the right thing. Wharanui is the heart and soul of our community. Please don't, don't take, take our, our pool. pool. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. You would have seen the coverage in this morning's paper. We've had um, extensive submissions on it. So thank you very much for making sure that the next generation are also having their voices heard. It's much appreciated. I want it as more of a personal approach, what it means to me, yeah. my girls, their children. I can't wait to watch their children swim. Yep. Understand. Yeah.
Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. No pressure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Thank you.